Welcome. My name is Bob Fall, and I'm here to tell you about my book, Energize. Now, I'm incredibly passionate about positive transformation on a personal level, on a team level, on an organizational level. And this passion really started when I was quite young. As a child, particularly as a teen, I was miserable. I was depressed. Uh, I ex unfortunately experienced a lot of violence and hatred and negative, ne negative situations that are, many of them are unspeakable. And as a result, I was uh, very depressed. I was a rebel. I was in trouble with school. I was in trouble with the law. It was just a terrible situation. Thankfully, when I got out of school and I, as an adult, I started to learn that there were more things to life. I, I met some people that not only cared about me, uh, which was amazing, right, and helped me believe in myself, but also helped me see that I could have a better life for myself. So that was really exciting. And that somehow sparked off this incredible desire to learn more about how to transform, how to transform myself. And I also learned that I really love working with people. I loved helping other people go through transformations. And that, it could be a deep transformation like I'd gone through, or it could be a, just improving the way they worked together or the way they thought about life, about the way they got along in their relationships, whatever it might be. It's, I love transformations, all big and small, as long as they're positive. So I decided that I wanted to take the core of all this best stuff and share it and energize. So the good news is I'm a brain geek. So <laughs> that means that I study the cutting edge brain and social sciences and I take that stuff and I really strive to take all the things that, that people are learning about on the cutting edge there and make it accessible to people, make it understandable. Hopefully, also make it entertaining and fun and really memorable. Motivation starts from within, so it's energize yourself. Use energize to move from getting in your own way to increasing confidence and increasing performance. Change the old limiting stories that play in your head to inner movies, as I call them, that are supercharged to help you move forward in your life and get what you want. What are these user-friendly brain tools? One example is I describe the brain in a way that's more interesting, I think anyway, and easier to understand. So instead of the primitive limbic system back here with the amygdala and the fight, flight, and freeze responses, I talk about the caveman part of our brain. Cavewoman if you prefer. This part of our brain is full of energy and excitement, but also anger and ready to fight and attack and thinks completely black and white all in the moment, very instantaneous. It's a wonderful part of us because it keeps us alive, but it also gets us into tons of trouble at work and in personal relationships. There's another part of our brain. This is up here, the most sophisticated and most advanced part of our brain, the neocortex, specifically the prefrontal cortex, and I call that the thinker. This is the seat of our analytical thinking. This is the part of our brain that can see far to the future, see into the past, learn from mistakes, really be able to apply logic and rationality to things. I've taken a little bit more artistic license even with the artist. The artist is that dynamic that happens in our brain where we're the most passionate and the most creative and we can perform at our best. It's that delightful balance where you have the energy of the caveman. The caveman is calm enough, but it's pumping energy into us and the thinker is focused and guiding us. Neither one is taking over. They're all working together. So we're at our best and we can produce the best work and in the way that feels the best to us. I also talk about the, what some social scientists call is our natural negativity bias. And there's a number of tools for being able to rebalance that negativity bias so that you can really be more effective. You can see things more realistically, uh, more balanced, and be far more effective in your thinking and your communication with other people. There's a few tools that I teach in Energize and a lot more that I teach in my courses and, and motivational speaking, but in Energize I teach some core skills to help with that. So one is really being a, your own inner movie director. Right? We have hundreds of inner movies play all day about whatever's going on in our lives, but we can choose what kind of inner movies sometimes to play periodically. We can't do too much of it, exhaust us, but enough that we can focus ourselves and prime our brains to be more effective, more confident when you're about to go into a tough situation. 
I do that before I do public speaking, for example, or before I go uh, teach a course or something like that. I prime my brain so I walk in confident and excited. Also, there's positive reframing. So that's when something seems negative to you, look at the positive aspect to it. it. Describing that something in a way that guides people towards solutions rather than the blame game. The second, one of the most powerful tools that I go into great depth in this book is the positive change questions, or sometimes I call them the energized questions. Three simple yet incredibly powerful steps to transforming ideas, people, teams, and outcomes. One other tool is what I call the inner autobiography, right? In our brains, we have a story way in the back of who we are in the world, what the world means to us, what our chances are being good or successful or liked or hated or all that kind of stuff. And one of the things we talk about is how you can rewrite portions of that so that you can be more effective and see the world more clearly and with more pride and more confidence to move forward. So I hope this book is really helpful to you, but also in addition to that, I'm so passionate about transformation, I also like to give free resources as well. So if you go to my blog at energizedperformance.com, you can find, well it's not just a blog actually, there's a blog and there's all kinds of other free resources. On this website is a free worksheet that goes with the book. So you can go download that and then you can use it to help guide you as you do the activities from the book. You'll learn far more, you'll, you'll gain far more, and you'll transform far more if you do these activities. They're specifically designed to help you move forward on your transformation journey, whatever that might be for you. And if your transformation journey in your life also involves some deep, challenging issues like I had as a teenager, and I certainly have had throughout my life, but I keep healing more and more of them, feel free to go check out Vital Cycles. So vital cycles is helping people change the vicious cycles in their lives into vital cycles, and it's a positively healing program. There's free resources on the website, vitalcycles.org, and there's occasionally support groups and different things like that. So please check that out if you want to do that. And I would love to hear from you, either here on Amazon or on the website or anywhere that you want to give some information or how you're using these tools or if you have questions or ideas for the next book, whatever it might be. Thank you.